The special convocation ceremony held by the University of Meduguri on Friday, the 12th of August, 2022, which conferred on Al Haji Dr. Muhammadu Indimi, OFR, the chairman and chief executive of Oriental Energy, is the 11th honorary doctorate degree that have been conferred on him so far. He has also been a member of governing board of reputable institutions both within and outside Nigeria. Among the honorary doctorate degrees he received are that of Lynn University, Boca Raton, Florida, United States of America, Doctor of Law, Honorary Causa from the Irish American College, Dublin, Ireland, Doctor of Business Administration from the International University of Africa, Khartoum, Sudan. Other doctorate awards Dr. Indimi received are from University of Uyo, Lagos, and University of Nigeria, and Suka, and Kwara State University, as well as from Kaduna State University. Dr. Muhammad Indimi, the Chairman and Chief Executive, Oriental Energy Resources Limited, who did not acquire formal education, learned to read and write as an adult through self-education, and speaks Kanuri, Hausa, Fulfuldi, Arabic, English and French. Indimi rose to greatness through the help of his father, who introduced him to commercial transactions at the tender age of 10. At the age of 16, Indimi started his business career by establishing a bicycle rental outfit. Through hard work and perseverance, Al Haji Muhammad Indimi developed and distinguished himself as a highly successful an astute businessman with notable presence in international business. Also through his Oriental and M and W pump, he has created and provided avenues of employment for his local community, country, and the international community at large. To earn his honorary doctorate degree, Indemi Foundation has provided special interventions for the development of educational institutions far and near including construction of a center for distance learning and auditorium at the University of Meduguri with 1,800 sitting capacity. By the authority of Council and Senate, I confer upon you the degree of Doctor of Letters of the University of Maiduguri, Honoris Causa University of Congratulations. Congratulations. I feel highly honored and privileged to receive this award and coincidentally on my birthday there can be no better birthday gift than this. I'm grateful to the University Council and the management for finding me worthy of great leaders. Also through his humanitarian services, he has provided scholarship for students to pursue further education in Nigeria and abroad. In the Miss Foundation has equally provided needed medical equipment to the University of Meduguri Teaching Hospital UMTH and sponsored many who needed specialist treatment for the needy patients within and outside Nigeria. Al Haji Dr. Muhammad Indimi is also active in providing palliatives to the internally displaced persons IDPs affected by the insurgency in the northeastern Nigeria and has constructed estates consisting of 100 housing units for the IDPs and victims of insurgency. With these numerous contributions and achievements of Dr. Indimi to humanity globally, 
the University of Meduguri deems it fit to hold a special convocation in honor of this rare gem and great philanthropist of repute to confer on him honorary degree of Doctor of Letters. Added to his honors, Dr. Indimi is the Pro-Chancellor of Borno State University, both member of the International University of Africa, Khartoum, Sudan, and also a board member of the Irish American College, Dublin, Ireland. The Pro-Chancellor and Chairman of the Governing Council of the University of Meduguri, Balama Manu, says the convocation ceremony was designed to honor a person of great personal stature who by individual drive, hard work and dedication has become a positive figure of reference in the Nigerian society and beyond. Nigerian universities need enormous resources to continue teaching, research, learning and community service. It is apparent given the realities of paucity of resources that well-meaning individuals and concerned citizens need to continually come to the aid of the universities. Dr. Muhammad Indimi, the chairman of Oriental Energy Resources Limited, has taken the gauntlet by making a landmark contribution to the development of the University of Maiduguri. I pray to Allah to continue to bless him, replenish his resources so that he would continue to make more contributions for the benefit of humanity. Uh, turning to our alumni, we should call on them, both in Nigeria and in the diaspora, to take up the challenge of providing resources to our dear university uh, by giving back to their alma mater. In his speech, the Vice Chancellor, University of Meduguri, Professor Aliu Shugaba, described Indimi as a distinguished elder statesman, a philanthropist, and an international business tycoon and illustrious son of Bornu. He said the conferment of honorary doctorate degree on Al Haji Dr. Indimi is to appreciate his remarkable achievements and to encourage other well to do individuals to emulate his philanthropic passion especially in supporting the vulnerable in the society and for educational development. Alaji Dr. Muhammad Indimi has supported many indigent students in Borno State, his home state, and even in faraway states like Akwa Ibom and other states in the southern parts of the country. It is on record that Alhaji Dr. Indimi has provided vital education infrastructure in the International University of Africa, IUA Sudan, in faraway Lynn University, Florida, United States of America, and of course, not forgetting to mention this multi-billion naira magnificent edifice where we are right now seated and holding this special convocation today in this university. I believe that his best is yet to come. In an age where the good things people do are written on the sands of the seashore and their shortcomings are engraved on platters of gold, it is important, it is instructive to be honored by a distinguished community for one's modest contributions. From today, Alaji Indimi is an alumnus of our great university, the University of Maiduguri, where great men are made. Our slogan remains, if you want to be made, come to Unimade. We therefore join Alhaji Dr. Indimi's beloved family and friends to wish him longer life in sound health, more wisdom, and prosperity, as well as God's protection as he continues to provide service to humanity. President Muhammad Buhari, in his message as the visitor to the university, represented by his chief of staff, Professor Ibrahim Gambari, congratulated Dr. Indimi for the well-deserved award and commended his contributions in the area of education, health, and humanitarian services. It is undoubtedly in recognition of your commitment as a proud son of Bonu and a conscientious philanthropist who has supported education 
as the sure pathway for the upliftment of his people towards a better life that such an award is bestowed on you. I join your family and friends across the length and breadth of this nation and abroad in celebrating this auspicious moment. It is my prayer that Almighty Allah keep you in good health so that our nation continues to benefit from your services to humanities. Congratulations once again and happy birthday, Muhammadu Buhari, President, Federal Republic of Nigeria. Former President Olushegun Obasanjo says the business Mogul is a model of self-made man. Without ever going into any formal class for education, you have achieved what you have achieved in education, in business, in philanthropy, in development, in international business. My dear brother, my dear friend, I congratulate you. And I will say this, the sky is still the limit. Where you have reached, it's high, but it's not the limit. We expect you to continue to rise because there's always something to contribute to make this country great. The chairman and chief executive officer, Oriental Energy Resources, Dr. Muhammad Indimi, appreciated the honor done him and promised to do more for the society. University of Meduguri is the largest uh, university in Nigeria with a population of 98,000. I received more than 10 doctorate worldwide, but this one is very, very special. For my home university to recognize me, to honor me with the doctorate, I really appreciate that. I'm still happy, still happy. Go home when you are driving anywhere in the northern Nigeria today. You will see children, a lot of them out of school. And whether we like it or not, they are our future leaders. Can we afford to have our future leaders without education? I don't think so. So I'm doing my best. If others can do the same, I know we cannot give everybody. But let's do our best so that at least the future leaders, they can have good education. So it's very important for me to do what I'm doing. I don't want them to be like me. You see them the way they are. That's the way I was before. And if I see them, I cry, I cry. I wish God can make me to give everybody. But it's impossible, but I will do my best. Because those children, especially in Maiduguri, we have to do something. Because whether we like it or not, they are our future leaders. If not, then future Boko Haram. So we have to help. As a mark of honor and respect for the elder statesman, the University of Maiduguri Foda organized a colorful pre-convocation dinner and convocation luncheon where dignitaries and important personalities from across the globe attended.
Borno State Governor Professor Babagana Umar Azulum represented by his deputy Umar Usman Kadafur friends and associates of the honorary graduate described the honor as great considering his immense contributions to humanity distinguished invited guests ladies and gentlemen Mohammed Indimi need not introduction here but as a worthy son of Borno State whose remarkable business acumen of philanthropic activities have impacted positively on the humanitarian efforts during the insurgency and beyond. The recognition is in order. Alaji Mohammed Indimi is a reputable businessman with unquestionable commitment to the common man and indeed a man of uncommon ideas and principles, impacting positively on the lives, on the lives of our thousands of our citizens who are in their need of attention. He can therefore best be described as a man of incredible sympathy for the most vulnerable in the house of needs. Alhaji Dr. Mohammed Indimi has been a major factor in our recovery drive through commendable and elaborative collaboration with the state government after the Boko Haram insurgency to ensure speedy recovery. Bono State government has, forced, has faced a lot of challenges, but through collaboration with such individuals, an organization is bouncing back. It is on this note that I wish you this opportunity to thank the entire University of Meluguri community for honoring our worthy son of Borno State. May I equally call upon other sons and daughters of our dear states to step into this kind of endeavor. I pray for Allah to grant him good health and strength to enable him to continue with what he loved to do to others, which is humanitarian interventions, among many endeavors. Um, I'm highly proud and elated that uh, he got this honor, which is a very well-deserved honor. And uh, of course, I'm not surprised that he got this honor, because they say charity begins at home. Yeah, he's been getting honors outside the shores of this country, and now he's been honored here. He's been honored here in the past, for no state university, etc. You know, so this honor by the University of Meduguri is a well-deserved honor, and uh, I'm happy for him, and I'm proud of this achievement he has achieved. Uh, a very old and uh, associate of the doctor. I, I have been his legal advisor for over 15 years or 20 years. And I have enjoyed every moment of being with him. I've learned a lot from him. He's a, he's a, he's a true... Uh, he's a university on his own. Uh, he's uh, well vast and he's well knowledge. You can open any topic with him and he will... He will discuss with you. He's a man that uh, truly deserves whatever award he gets. And I pray that God gives him good health and long life so that, as Mr. President said, he can continue with the good work he's doing for his uh, country and for the African continent in general and uh, for his friends also uh, and his family. I am very, very happy and proud to be among uh, the distinguished guests that have attended this uh, ceremony. And I can only pray for his uh, uh, long life and good health, inshallah. It's an honor well deserved because uh, here's a man that never went to any formal school or through any formal education and he achieved so much not only in business, not only in international business, but also became a, a tremendous uh, philanthropist. So for me, there are three main um, um, reasons why I feel honored to be here. First, as a friend and brother for over close to 40 years. Um, and um, also as an academic myself, to attend a, a, a special convocation of the University of Meduguri um, I feel very much at home uh, and I recognize the value of honorary degrees um, for people who deserve honor and who have made contributions that are extraordinary. And I said yesterday 
there are two types of uh, honorary degree holders. People who uh, are elevated by the honor, by the university, but those who actually give honor to the university that is honoring them, um, to count him as one of their uh, graduates, honorary graduates. But the third reason, of course, above all, is that I came here as, to represent Mr. President. He asked me to represent him because he wants to make the point that those who have made tremendous contribution in their profession, in terms of what they do to help the larger society, in terms of contribution, uh, uh, they deserve the honor. Elijah Indimi is, um, is an excellent fellow um, who has a sterling reputation in the oil industry as an oil entrepreneur. Um, is one of the foremost indigenous producers of, um, of, of oil in the country and is an international businessman of great repute in, in many other countries. But um, I think for us, um, we have no choice but to come here to honor him and um, we are extremely happy not just about what he's done in the, in the oil industry but the amount of charity he has done. Because you will never really be remembered for what you create, it's what you give that you'll be remembered for. And he's done an, an excellent job of doing that. The hall we sit in is donated by him. A lot of work has gone into th thousands of buildings in the IDP camp. And his foundation has done not just charitable work, but developmental work within his community. And he must be, he must be um, uh, exalted for the work he has done. Governor of Gombe State, top government functionaries from Yobe State and other states of the Federation, Shew of Borno, Abu Bakr Ibn Umar Garbe Al Amin Al Kenemi, Amers within Borno and beyond, astute politicians, among other prominent personalities, witnessed the conferment of the prestigious award on Dr. Indimi. It is worth knowing that the conferment of the honorary doctorate degree on Dr. Indimi coincided with his 75th birthday, where a mini birthday celebration was held shortly after the special convocation with the First Lady of Nigeria, Aisha Buhari, alongside family members in attendance. To reach 75 years in life is not easy, but Alhamdulillah, I am healthy, I feel good, I do my exercise, and uh, keep praying for myself and the, my people and the country in general, and uh, definitely I'm happy, very happy man, I don't envy anybody, and uh, Looking forward to 80 or 85, if I reach that healthy, because I'm very good in health. So keep praying. I will invite you for the 80 years in five years. <laughs> 